This is JJ with Merrick Plumbing in Sarasota, Florida. I'm going to do a quick video today on a topic I've been asked by a few customers on how to remove your tub stopper in a lift and turn style tub drain for your bathtub. So there's two different styles. On one of them, you can turn your lift and turn until it goes down and just put downward pressure and turn left counterclockwise and the entire assembly will spin out. That's one of them. This one is the second design, which this top screw, and the way to find out is usually if this top hat on here is knurled and has these rough edges, usually in that case, this will unscrew. Now this home is only a year old, so this unscrews nice and easy for me. Sometimes you will actually have to use a pair of large pliers like channel locks to hold the actual stopper while you use another pair of channel locks to loosen this top hat. But with this being new, I'm lucky that I can just unscrew it. So that unscrews. And then this one is nice because it has a slot for a standard flathead screwdriver that I can use, or sometimes they're loose enough, you can do it by hand. Some of them will have a square in there that you could stick a quarter inch dry ratchet, but usually if you just even grab that with a pair of small channel locks, it will unscrew. So you can unscrew that, pull out your stopper, and then if there's any hair in there, you can remove it from the crossbars. And then if you wanna make it easier for in the future, you can just pick up some faucet grease and wipe a little bit of faucet grease on those threads as well as on this brass shank and then it will move up and down nice and smooth for you and it will be easy to come out. So that's a nice simple way to remove your tub stopper. I hope that's helpful for you. Enjoy.